to Max Doggy Gaming. I'm Max Doggy, and we're doing a gaming channel video. Surprise, hello, long time no see. Um, so in case you can't read the title of the video, we're doing a bit of an unboxing today, which is really cool. But I do want to just bring out these two controllers that I've already gotten. Um, so you got the Halo 5 Guardians, or the Spartan Lock controller, and then the Master Chief controller. They're all pretty awesome, but that's not really what we care about. So let me just set those now. Um, but yeah. Here is the limited collector's edition of the Halo 5 Guardians stuff. So in terms of stuff, you get a whole bunch of stuff in there. What kind of stuff? All this stuff that you can see on the back. We're going to open this box and it will be fun and enjoyable. Yay! Alright. You can't see what's in here. That's great. Okay. Ah, so here is fun stuff and things. Um, so then you're going to tear this out and this fits like it's like basically super in there and it, yeah, it's really hard and difficult to get out. So in case you wanted some legalese, here's some legalese for you saying uh, don't hurt yourself and if you have photosensitive seizures you should not play this video game. Fun fact, so this little box here is little, it has information on it and a friendly sticker which is always very useful. Um, but when you open it up you get a whole bunch of stuff. So like you have the download card for Halo 5 Guardians. No, I will not show you the back because I like my code. Okay. Um, and then you also get a 14-day Xbox Live trial. So in case you don't have Xbox Live, but for some reason are buying an online video game, you can play it for 14 days. And then you have this actually this really cool operation order. Um, and it's front and back. Front side is English, back side is in French. Because apparently France also gets the same version of the packaging. Um, but it's basically an order saying, hey Spartan Lock get Master Chief, Kelly, Fred, and Linda, and bring them back in, you know, safe and sound. But there's a really interesting phrase. Uh, you're allowed to use deadly force, and warning shots are not authorized. Fire only aimed shots. So basically, he's saying if you get the drop on the Master Chief, go ahead and shoot him. So if you watch the trailer, he says, last chance to stand down, Master Chief, or whatever he said in the trailer. So we know that he doesn't listen to this order. Spoiler alert. All right. So, the next, this is the really cool thing that I really wanted to show you, and I had no idea what it was. Metal. Um, so this is laser etched metal. This is actually, you can make it into a guardian um, that, from the Halo 5 Guardians. And there's a really in-depth instruction booklet, and there's like videos and a website you can visit. And this is way above my head. And the final result is gonna look like that. Or as on the back of the image here, it's going to look like this over here. Um, according to Reddit, um, it's really difficult to put together and if you have no semblance of modeling skill like myself, you won't be able to do it. So I might have my roommate do it and just, you know, force him to do it. Otherwise, I may, you know, murder him in his sleep. Um, he's totally not holding the camera right now and judging me silently. Um, yeah, so there's that. Fun stuff. And then you have this nice bright green package. Now in this bright green package, which is addressed to Jameson Locke, which if you don't know, is Spartan Locke, um, you open this up and you'll get some dossiers about all the different Spartans. So you have like Blue Team, you have John, also in French on the back, in case you want to learn how to speak French and read French. Then you have Kelly, you have Linda, you have Frederick, and then you have, oh, Spartan Locke, here's a profile about yourself, you narcissist. <laughs> okay, and then you have Spartan Buck, which, interesting fact, according to this birth date, he's the same age as like Master Chief and Fred and Linda and Kelly, while all of these other Locke, Tanaka, and Vale, they're all about 10 years younger than them. So, Buck, OG, pretty great man. So, I'm gonna put this aside. So, with this, you do get the digital copy, there's no room for the physical copy. If you did buy this Legendary Edition, the Legendary Collector's Edition, can trade it in for a disc if you would like. Um, you basically, you, you don't use the code. You contact Microsoft, say, hey, I want the physical disc. Then they'll send you the disc once you send them the digital code. So there's that ability and that function. Um, but yeah, cool, nice steel case. Um, but not for the moment of truth, which is gonna be really difficult to show you because this is a very small island. Um, we're gonna pull this apart here and hope that Master Chief and Locke don't fall into the sink. That'd be hilarious if it did happen that way. But there's this box thing. I want to maneuver it ever so carefully. There's no grips on it. And then, da -da -da -da! holy crap, it's really large. Okay. So 
there's plastic and stuff and things, but you can totally see that there's a Master Chief and a Spartan lock there. Um, and they added this nice plastic finish around it to kind of give it the effect that like they're all under cover and stuff like that. Um, I think it was really authentic what they did here, just kind of saying, hey, you know, you have this Master Chief and you have this lock, and it's kind of like we're covering up the story, you know, hunt the truth, got to find the truth there. Um, so that was really interesting. So I'm actually going to carefully take this out and not over a sink. So uh, give me a quick minute. And then it's magnetic. Oh, it's magnetic. Oh, so you have Master Chief and Spartan Lock, and it appears that they're walking together, but they're also hunting each other. So what you really wanted to, if you really could, you could do this, and they're like, oh, they're looking away. And then you could totally do this if you wanted to, and they're like, oh, they're looking at each other, but he's really pointing a gun at him, and he's just like, hey, I'm gonna Spartan charge you, because new ability in Halo 5, Spartan charge. Um, or if you really wanted to, they could totally be like this, just looking up at the sky. And that's something that you could do as well. Um, but you have all sorts of options with these. Um, they're not very heavy. Um, they're probably about, you know, five pounds each, 10 pounds in total. Um, they do move around a bit. They are set in place. You can't really close them or anything. Um, but this is it's fantastically large compared to the Halo Reach statue, which you might know. Uh, it was probably about, Halo Reach statue probably about this tall. And the figures were probably about this big. Um, so this is a really nice improvement to it. I really like this. I just have no idea where I'm going to put it. Um, but yeah, so this is the $250 limited collector's edition of Halo 5. I'm Max Lucky Gaming. You watched an unboxing video. Why? I have no idea. But hey, thanks for showing up and playing along. Um, that person behind the camera is Chris. Um, I could give you his last name, but you know he might kill me in my sleep as opposed to as we talked about previously. So yeah, this is Max Lucky Gaming. I'll see you on the 27th. Hunt the truth. In this little tin was a head. First skull of Halo 5, right here, world first, Max Huggy Gaming. Bonk.